Okay, this is how you save the world bit by bit. Get your children, as young as they are, to start weeding by hand. This is my jasmine tree. I got this place sight unseen about a year ago, but the, there was five foot weeds in this place. Five foot. And um, I weeded it all by hand at the end of the summer last year. And then this year as well, I'm just going down every day for 20 minutes and picking weeds, and it develops everything because you're you're picking out the trailing weeds, uh, like the clover, because they have a trail, you see, and it shows you how to uh, pick things in the right way. So here's a little pile. So all you have to do is is pay the kids, say five dollars, for a basket of weeds every day and your lawn is going to get the upper hand because the grass needs to not be choked out. You see, like, see this weed here? You, um, it's just one little clover, but if you keep digging with the rest of your fingers, you'll find that it's got this long tendril. This long tendril goes way beyond the little thing, and that's what's choking out the grass. You don't have to do the whole thing. You just need to let the grass get the upper hand. But this develops military intelligence, it develops philosophical intelligence, develops everything. Uh, yes, it's a little hard, but actually, you know, you get, you get to hear the crickets. Because I don't blast uh, a big, huge thing, I'm smelling the jasmine trees, I'm smelling the birds. I am not a gardener by any stretch. This is the first time I've ever done this, but now I, I see how how human beings can, are really gardeners. Like, we can really carve things out, but it takes the time. And, of course, I like to kill two birds with one stone. I don't just uh, do it because I like to show off to the neighbors how I fixed I fixed the, 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 the local um, eyesore. But um, I'm still not happy with the overwatering. I have no control over the underground sprinklers, but I'm learning some things. But uh, th this is something that little kids could do because your fingers are meant to do this, not touch touch screens. You're getting more and more detached from nature this, that way. Pam, that's a good good uh, way of life. Pay pay the kids per basket or per pound. Then there's some incentive and you're doing a lot of good there.